it's been a tradition here, you know. It's an event that brings thousands of people to Pueblo West every 4th of July. I like it because mostly every day is burning hot for me. So like it's a time to like me to chill out in the hot day. It's one of his favorite things to do. But like so many other things this year, the wet dry parade is a no go. Everybody is really sad about them canceling it. That's why Sarah Hoff says some people are planning to have their own wet parade on Saturday. There's been a group on Facebook that is going to do a water fight in the same type of location. And I know that there are several residents out here that are going to be going. I feel like things have been closed too long and I'm for it. I'll be bringing my children if they do it. The Pueblo West Metropolitan District made the call to cancel the annual event to those who might be trying to plan their own. So when you end up going to events of that size or gathering, you're putting yourself or others at risk. So we ask people to consider that. While it's not exactly clear where people might be doing a water fight on Saturday. We will be having deputies out on Joe Martinez going up and down. Joe Martinez Boulevard is posted no parking anytime. So if anybody pulls up and parks, it is a public safety issue. We would have to contact them and say, hey, we can't park here at this time. Daniel Kershaw and her family won't be participating in any big event that might happen, but they're still planning to celebrate in their own way. We have a nice alley in the back that we share with several houses, and we've all decided that we're just going to hook up all of our sprinklers, walk off the alley from the public, and just have one big old uh, neighborhood little wet parade of our own. Always watching out for you, Pueblo West. Katie Blaze, News 5.